You may have admired the Obama's Portuguese water dogs in the White House. Or, like me, you've spent time with a super cute one at a friend's lake cottage in Muskoka. You may be wondering if a Portuguese water dog is the right breed for you. They are a relatively rare breed, and I realized I didn't know too much about them, except I assumed they had something to do with Portugal and they liked the water. By coincidence, Hannah, who films and edits with me, is a big fan, and her family just got a second Portuguese water dog puppy. So we decided to do some more research and share our findings. Some quick facts about Portuguese water dogs. They are intelligent, energetic, and independent, and they tend to really love and bond with their owners and enjoy being close and snuggling at the end of a long day playing outside. Adorable Buster thinks he's a big lap dog. The AKC describe them as affectionate, adventurous, and athletic medium-sized working dogs. These robust dogs have webbed toes for swimming, a solidly built muscular body, and strong legs. Their eyes are black or various tones of brown, and their coats can be black, brown, black and white, or brown and white. As water dogs, their retrieving instinct is strong, which may give them tugging tendencies. Some may walk, hop, or dance on their hind legs when excited. One question people often ask when considering a dog is, do they shed? Portuguese water dogs do not shed, unlike Kilo the pug. <laughs> this is great news if you have allergies or you do not like cleaning black hair off white sofas, clothes, and bedding daily. Portuguese water dogs have either a curly or wavy coat, which dries quickly after swimming or bathing. They need regular grooming and brushing to avoid tangles and mats. They also need regular haircuts, or the hair will keep growing and may block the eyes or cause skin problems. The traditional haircut is called the lion trim. However, they can also have a retriever cut, where they're more evenly shaven all over the body. The Portuguese water dog is a working dog. They reportedly originally came from the Algarve on the southern coast of Portugal. They were used by sailors to help herd fish into nets, to retrieve lost tackle or broken nets, and to act as couriers from ship to ship or ship to shore. In the early 1900s, a monk reported seeing a black curly-haired dog bringing a sailor to land. Apparently, the breed was on the verge of extinction when in the 1930s, a wealthy Portuguese shipping magnet began to seek out fishermen's dogs for use in a breeding program to re-establish the breed. In 1972, Ms. Miller, along with 14 others, formed the Portuguese Water Dog Club of America. As with all purebred dogs, Portuguese water dogs are vulnerable to certain genetic defects or illnesses, 